Right now, as we export the TIFF file, it's time to open this in Photoshop. And I do this no different as with other things I open do the I open this through the bridge, of course. And let me find the files. As you can see I didn't set anything here. So I have to find my course, course images. As, and as you remember, I save them in the folder Proceed, and I will be saving here all my file files just in this folder for the course. So I can just double hit and my image will be open in Photoshop. Before we start any editing and before I will go deeper with uh, all of the tools, let's talk about uh, the portrait image and what has to be done. What's important about this? Maybe I create some help player. So I just hit and create a new layer. Not very important. And let's zoom this in as mostly, of course, we will be working with the skin. And uh, that's the key. And uh, let me discuss a few things. What has to be done? Because I saw a lot of portrait images that are overdone these days. And this is huge mistake done by, by most of the people. I don't want you to do this, right? So uh, let me choose a brush over here and maybe red color. So we will know what to do. The first thing, what you need to do with this image is spots. You need to clean all of the major spots. Sorry for this spot over here. I will not um, step back. Maybe I just erase that over here. Okay. So first of all, we have to clear up the spots. Like here, here, there's really plenty, including the small ones. Um, all of the spots has to be removed and there is no discussion about that. Um, all spots has to be removed, no matter what image is that. Um, I saw some retouches where people, and of course, different kind of spots. I will not be going deeper um, which sort of spot is that. But of course, uh, that is uh, something has to be done. Some people I saw retouch part and they do very deep dodge and burn, but they leave few spots. This is not something you, you have to do. Like you want to make image looking the best um, as, as the model. You want to make model looking as her best day. In her best day, she doesn't have spots, let's say. Um, so this is the first uh, thing. The other thing is we have moles like that. Let's um, let's place this. I'm not sure how how to spell it, so I just write like this. But I mean, of course, this sort of um, things. And maybe I will use a different color for this. And this is the thing that depends on you, depends on model, or depends on your customer because this is not the issue so uh, you can remove that if your customer and model or you wants that if you agree for doing that you can remove that but this is not something you would necessarily uh, remove from the portrait image or even from beauty image because this is not the skin issue as uh, the spots uh also here this one will be removed for sure so like i'm going to change the color into the red one so this will be removed for sure and this one probably i also uh, i'm also going to remove i'm just going to check what it's best for this image uh third thing that i see over here three hair and it will be the face hair she has quite many of them and this is not something you have to you have to do if the model doesn't have many of them but as you can see we have to try maybe to do something with with this part 
uh, whether it will be done by dodging and burning but I think I'm just going to darken this little hair uh, over here uh, it's not necessarily about portrait to work with the veins around the eyes um, this is portrait you don't want to make this too perfect you want to make this look natural so in the first clean up process this is the thing we need to sort out and as you can see it's not uh, that many of it the problem is how you're going to do this if you're going to do this right and I'm going to show you how to do this right then your image is going to look really perfect by the way sorry for my writing um, I'm trying to treat you um, like like my friend but probably I should pay more attention uh, to such a things but once again spots face her moles not always this is the things that you have to pay attention um, when you retouch portrait image